baseball of the minor league variety as the show brings you coverage from the AAA East. Tonight, game two of this three-game weekend series between the scranton Wilkesbury Rail Railriders and the Syracuse Mets. We've got baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Freddie McDaniel will be on the bump for game two of the series. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, this guy has a four-pitch repertoire, right? And those are a lot of nice options to have. You can go hard soft. You can go in and out. And any time you have four pitches, if you could throw them for strikes, you have the big advantage. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Fernando Tatis stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. Fellas, you take a look at our home standing ball club as they come into this one tonight. They do come in fresh off a of victory last time out, but they've been giving ground in the division of late. They've won just twice in their last seven games. Yeah, Maddie, this place is buzzing right now. This team won the opener of the series yesterday, and they're looking to step on this team's team. We'll have to leave it there as the play is made for the third out. At the plate now is Alden Gage. He went down looking in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few ABs where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. And that's out number one. Now to bat, Adrian Vega. And we'll see what he can do here after going deep his first time up. The one-two. Softly hit to short. Throw just in time, and oh, that was awfully close. So here is Fernando Tatis comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Hey, let's go, Tim. One time, right here. And the pitch. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. Hey, after that base knock right there, he's into double digits, Dero. That's a 10-game hitting streak. Oh, you talking about double digits, Dan? Now it's getting firm. We're seeing the batting average go up. We're seeing the homers go up. We're seeing the RBIs go up. Everything is moving north. Now out of the play, Curtis Ford. He bounced out last time up, and the runner back safely. dive back in safely. Tatis, base runner at first with one out. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Gage is there to put it away and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Next will be the designated hitter, Rick Hubble, 0 for 1 for him here in this one. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. In there. Now the throw. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. Hey, it's almost impossible to throw a base runner out that gets a lead that big. And plus, this catcher's not known for having a cannon of an arm. Striding forward now is the DH. Rick Hubble trying here to plate the tying run from second. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. Scooped dig, 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 dig. Beats him easily, and the side is retired. One hit, one left. Digging in, the switch hitter, Cullen Lard. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Hit on the ground is short. Reined in. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. So they go quietly here in this half inning. Now with the plate is Fernando Tatis, singled in his last at bat. Fernando. Hey, let it rip one time. Get it right here. Come on, baby, swear it up. Here's the pitch. High in the air out to center field. Long run for the center fielder. He makes the catch, a great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. So stepping in is Adrian Vega, now grounded out in his last at bat. Adrian. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. Throw on. 
down to first, two gone. And now, Dave Marchant, runner in scoring position with two gone. Bouncer to the left side. And that's through, a base hit. Tack on another here as the runner scores from second. Boy, I'll tell you what, that's a big RBI late in game. Ready now is Fernando Tatis. Flew out last time up. First pitch of the A-B now. Oh, and he hung the slider here, and it's a towering drive out to deep left field. This ball is gone. A home run. So a two-run homer down the line in left, and we are tied again. What a great feeling right there as he circles the pillows. Finally able to get this offense potentially going with one swing of the bat. Being shut out all game, but not anymore. So now into the box is Cullen Large. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. A ball and two strikes. Hit on the ground out to short. Over to first, and that retires the side. So they can't get that winning run home, and that means we'll have to go a little longer tonight to find a winner. Nine can't decide a winner. We'll move ahead to the tenth, and we are tied 2-2. All right, one time, one time. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring forth the slugging shortstop, Fernando Tatis. Tatis. Here's the first pitch. High and deep to center field. Center fielder going back to the track. Out of here to the deepest part of the yard. Two run shot to straight away center as they've taken a two run lead. Usually in extra innings, you wait around for someone to run into one. He took matters into his own hands. Now it's up to his pitching staff to grab the W. Fernando Tatis stands in looking for home run number three right here as you see what he's done so far in this one. From the stretch. High in the air out to center field. No, no, right on. You're scoring, you're scoring. Childress is there and he puts it away to stop the bleeding. All told, ten men come to the plate here. Six of them score. So now we'll see if these guys can get even in the bottom of inning number ten. Scranton leads it eight to two. Hey, it took them an extra frame to do it, but hey, they're not going to complain as they lock up a nice road victory here in 10 innings. 8-2 to two tonight's final. Sammy Valido claims the win out of the pen his first. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website, theshow.com.